Welcome to the family. Okay, so apparently they're filming a show for HBO on my street today. And we got all of these letters and all of the stuff that's happening. So let's see what I can see. I'm using Gizmo as a ploy. So we got a lot of extra cars and trucks on the street. So today you guys are gonna learn how to make French toast. First time I saw, I saw how to do French toast, I was like, this is so, like, this is it. Easy. I, I could eat this every day. Yeah. It's very easy. Have my eggs. That's somewhere where I can evenly spread out the egg onto the sliced bread. Uh -huh. I pan it so that it doesn't stick on there. I'm putting ice in a blender because I don't know yet. What am I putting ice in a blender no, for? No, no, no. I need half of that. That's about half. I'm making a banana shake. Mm. Uh, I'm doing a shake. So, um, that's how you spell liquefy? So I just met Jeff who does um, generators for all the big movie sets apparently down here and all over the place. He's actually located in New Orleans and he said that apparently for movie sets cameras can't fluctuate on power so they always provide their own power and shut down the house's power. I thought that was pretty cool. Oh, now we got cops with officially shut down roads and the cop is going to come over here now. So I don't know if you can see behind me or not. But if I go like this, maybe you can. See all the cop cars? It's kind of crazy. All right, Gizmo, this isn't a real walk. Come on. This is an undercover mission. So far, you got me one lead. Unfortunately, everybody has cleared off a bit because it's starting to rain. I might not get that second lead. Beautiful day out there. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Get some cups for the school. Good morning, gentlemen. School's to me. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. <laughs> but I think you should do shock and awe. No, 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 I don't want to do balls. Every time I oh, put on that hat, it just was. Like, the only reason why I'm not. What did you say? The hat picture. You look, yeah, I, I wanted like, to give him like, like balls. I felt like I was oh, he was sick. Boy. <laughs> I look sick. Yeah, you look horrible. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just happy that when I get really. I'd like to see you bald. I'd like to see you bald with a beanie. Oh, gosh. Yeah, like that. You know what I think you should do then? I think you should shave one eyebrow off. No, what is this? No. Nah, I said no. I don't know. We already did it. Get a blow up. I don't want to do it. I'm get a blow up. Listen to you, man. Yeah, so we can't take you places. Yeah. We're what do you mean? A blow up? I think that's one of the whole Mohawk in Belize. No, nothing's going to Oh, that's right. We're about to go to Belize. You're going to do it again? You haven't had a funky hair. Miles, one time. Dude, she freaking takes me oh, to the yeah. Lion Salon, all right, over by Dadeland. I tell the, the the hair person, are you used to cutting thick hair? Because my hair the is really stylist. thick. The hairstylist. My hair was She's this long. She's saying hairstylist, not the hair person. Uh -huh. Okay. Yeah. It was this long. The it was that long. The lady cut it so, so short years ago. and so like disproportionate, <laughs> it looked like your hair. Oh, Jesus Christ. That's pretty I literally bad. went from she this. She went from that? I had to go back the next day so that. the owner could fix my hair. I left there in tears. And my mom and Bert were so pissed. I would go oh, there. I was crying. I would be so mad. Air. I was crying. I would sue them. I don't know what they're doing actually. But they're doing something. Maybe they're just trying to fix a car. This road is most definitely, definitely closed. Damn, that's where I should have walked. I got one lead that I actually met. And then I did actually, no, I take that back. I got another one because I met the assistant. I forgot what his, his title is, but I met the guy who was coordinating everything because he came to my grandmother's door to give her a check to use her driveway. And I have all of his information because he had contacted my uncle and my uncle sent me the email. So I actually have two leads. I have achieved my goal. <laughs> so we're here, we're, uh, we're trying to fix Dylan's bike. Hey guys. He's not using it anymore. So what happens is... Look, that's LJ's bike. <laughs> hey, Chevy Gun. Upgrade. Chevy Gun, you wanted to see his bike? Look at his bike. Yeah, he's biking and wheeling, boy. Only in Miami do you have a car accident where people don't move out of the way. That's a nasty accident, but the car behind it can certainly get out of the way. <laughs> but they choose not to. So that everybody has to hang out. It's uh -huh. Miami. Yay! Wanna go around the motorcycles, boys? <laughs> this is hilarious, dude. What? Little Harley bikes. I can feel my nose 
vibrating. <laughs> I'm Bert Oliva from Bold Worlds. Welcome to the family show. And what I. What? Yeah, it's kind of difficult when you talk to yourself. So, what I want you to do is I want you to comment, subscribe, forward, repost, do whatever it is that you're gonna do to make sure no one misses this show. But do it now. Do, do, what are you waiting for? Do it now. Now.